Hello Pisces, it's Milady from Milady's Way Tarot and I'm coming to do your weekly reading from July 10th through July 17th, 2017. The cards I am using today are Oracle of the Mermaid cards by Lucy Cavendish. And I close off with my Miss Cleo cards. I like to read those straight out of the book to ensure you get your full message. Um, I want to thank everybody for like, sharing, and subscribing to my videos. Um, and setting up personal readings. If you want one, check in the description box below. Um, I think I said make sure to check your sun, moon, and rising signs. And don't forget to subscribe if you haven't. Alright, other than that, let's get this show on the road. Pisces, Pisces, Pisces. July 10th through 17th, 2017. July 10th through 17th, 2017. Okay, there is some love here. There's some love in the air. Let's go. Let's go. I like it already. Mm. Okay. So, there's love here, but I feel like somebody is just not putting all their emotions into it. Or they're just not showing it. Okay? Somebody's not showing their emotions here. Wow, and they're contemplating time out. What's going on here? All right, why are they contemplating time out? Why is the Pisces contemplating time out? Okay, so somebody's been uh, not being able to sleep. Like, then they've been getting like crazy messages in their dreams. And let's see what these dreams are about. What are these dreams about for the Pisces? Mm. Manipulation. Okay. So, this is what I see that's going on. So, you got a relationship. Everybody's in love here. Okay? Here, the... Pisces believe the Pisces is being emotionally drained by are we gonna say a Scorpio but the Scorpio okay one person like is really like feelings 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 and the other one is like they don't show no emotion you know so I feel like maybe Pisces, I'm going to just say that you're the one that's not showing any emotion and the Scorpio is showing you all the emotion and that like offsets your relationship and you're ready to leave because this person wants you to show emotion and you're not that type of person. That's what I'm, I'm seeing here. Mm. But this manipulation card though, what is this manipulation card about? Okay, jump. Well, we got two. Let's see. Sacrifice and moving on. So I feel like. I feel like you finally found somebody you, you like, but you're not really in the sacrifice. Your. Your emotions, like how you're not really ready, you're not just a person that put your emotions out there like that. And I feel like your partner is trying to manipulate you into doing this kind of stuff, like the whole pity party, to get you to pull your your feelings out. And your feelings are out, but they just aren't the same. Yeah, your feelings just aren't the same. Like. I don't express emotion like you express emotion. Okay. Yeah. This basically them feeling like your partner feeling like you're up to no good because your feelings aren't like on your sleeve and it's wrong. They're wrong.
Yeah, this makes me feel like um, you've been helping this person out. You've been helping this person out of the darkness. It's crazy. I feel like you give this person everything they want, but they want the thing that they can't have, and that's to change your emotions. Okay. Okay, so there's some secrets going on. What are these secrets about for the Pisces? What's going on with this Pisces? What are these secrets about? Okay. Uh, okay, so I don't know what's going on here, but maybe somebody bought somebody a secret gift. I don't know. Okay, so friends are hating. This makes me feel like that, um, Pisces, you may be about to ask somebody to marry you or something. You bought them something or you're doing something to make them feel, show them that you love them. But I'm feeling like don't tell the friends. And if you already did, they're going to tell the partner. Okay? All right. Okay. I guess after you say this or do this, this is going to make the burdens lifted. So maybe... Maybe all this was about being married. Like, it, it's possible. This is a very strange reading. But I feel like... Yeah, it might be about getting married because it's like a little manipulation, a little secrets here and there, you know. And it's like this secret in the present made me feel like it might be somebody was just being mysterious this week because they was trying to put some stuff together. To, to prove they love or to show emotion. Yeah, of course, you've been saving money, holding out on them. And they feel like that goes back to here. They like you're not showing your emotions and stuff. So you were the manipulator. Both of y'all was manipulating. You was trying to act like, you know, something wasn't right, you know, because you was trying to hide that you up here trying to get this wedding ring. This is crazy. But it's cute. She almost broke y'all up. <laughs> All right. All right, Pisces, Pisces, Pisces. July 10th through 17th, 2017. Pisces. Yeah, so I think the friends either told, or if you didn't tell the friends, don't tell them because they're going to tell the partner that you are secretly trying to... Yep, it's going to end good. It's going to be lovely. That tried to come out. Uh-oh. Yeah, I think that's the friends, those damn powers. Or oh. I just leave that there. Apparently, it was supposed to come out. All right. Okay. So this might be being done to you, Pisces, just because Oh, somebody going to turn it down. That's crazy. All right. So what I see happening here before I read the book is like they're going to come out and be like, hey, you know, I just wanted to tell you that I love you, you know, and it's going to like shock everything because it's like you was acting like an asshole all week. Now you turn around and tell me that you want to marry me and then y'all end up getting into a fight. And somebody's going to turn the love offer down, like, at the first, like, I'm not marrying you kind of thing. I don't know if this is going to stick. For some of you, probably at least for a week it's going to stick. But this Knight of Coins makes me feel like, yeah, I feel like this is the offering of the wedding ring right here. But I feel like somebody turning it down. I think they're just being mad, though. I don't think there's no fool, like, I'm done. It's probably a couple minutes, couple of days, you know, but... I don't know. But let me read it. So first we have the world card. World, world, world. Pisces, you just got to give me a hard time. All the time. Uh, you may take a trip soon. Change your residence. Your world will see more options. And possibly... Sorry. 
possibilities. This is a time where anything is possible. Okay, of course. Then you have the tower card. Nobody likes the tower card. All right. So tower card. Change occurs in the blink of an eye. Great disruption has taken or will take place. Dramatic change is beliefs in beliefs or situations in the home. The disruption of t tradition, a shocking loss. What is thought to be true. I don't know. I just got sort of a feeling that these little friends over here, they not just going to tell. They trying to F some stuff up. They trying to mess up y'all happy home. They ain't really trying to mess up your happy home. I think they might be trying to get you. They know that you're getting ready to get married or somebody wants to marry you. But I feel like they're trying to get you to do stupid stuff so that it could cause a fight. But y'all trying to come out of that right now. So this might be in the past. They did some stupid stuff trying to cause fright and blah, 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 blah. All right. But just beware of friends, okay? All right, so we got the five of staffs. Five of staffs, five of staffs. All right, it's reverse, complicated, disrupt, I mean, uh, disputes, verbal and legal, deception, and inaccuracies. So, yeah, these friends are about to cause some stuff or something crazy because I did see the, I think the night of staffs earlier or something like that. Yeah, but so maybe some crazy stuff in the mail about to come. I still think it got something to do with just friends. Maybe your friends trying to sue you to stop the wedding because they know you need the money for it. You know, I don't know, but it's some crazy stuff. <laughs> All right, let's go with the page of coins. You know, I don't know, page of cups. All right, the page of cups is reverse. Manipulator, insecure, usury, illusion, and escape. Fantasy, unrealistic hopes, and constant, often seeking short-lived escapes. Yeah, so I'm feeling like uh, beware of friends in this situation because I just feel like only thing that's going to stop this marriage from going through is these nasty, manipulative friends. So I either don't tell them or run away <laughs> no it's just don't tell them but that's all i have for you guys make sure to check your sun moon and rising signs if you want a personal reading link below other than that have a great weekend week <laughs>